What's up guys, you watch another video. Today we are back in the M2 and we're actually at my parents' house today. Since we're out here, I wanna take advantage and I wanna give my family a ride in the M2. A lot of them have never been in fast cars before. Um, I've taken my dad in like a Huracan before. What other cars has my dad been in? In my cars, my GTR, stuff like that. But I think this might be faster than all of those cars I just mentioned. It is faster. This one makes almost 800 horsepower. This M2 is very, very fast. And it's very scary too, because it's rear wheel drive and it just spins. It feels like you're gonna lose control. And I know being in the passenger seat, it's very scary. So today, I'm gonna try to get some of my family's reactions. Hopefully give my dad a ride. I wanna introduce you guys to my little brother, give him a ride. My little big brother. My boy is bigger than me. He bought 200 pounds, bodybuilder type, but he's my little brother. <laughs> Hopefully I can introduce you guys to him, give him a ride. He always wants to go in fast cars, so I'll give him a ride, my dad a ride, maybe my brother-in-laws. If we can get some of the girls, my sisters, and my mom a ride, maybe, but I think they're gonna be too scared to get in this car, but let's get it, it's gonna be fun. This thing's fast. I know it's fast. It's so brand new. I know. What year is it? It's probably like 2023. Uh -huh. That's 3,000 miles on. What? Yeah. I think it just hit 4,000. Wow. Crazy on. Look how big the screen is. I know. Like, it's huge. Mm -hmm. Ready? Yep. <laughs> It's like you can't control it. The, the cars come up too quick, and like I so said, you better hope your brakes work. I know, I hate it. You being, don't have bold tires. I know how it feels. I hate being faster to see because you're not in control. Yeah. I see everyone giving us thumbs up. People love this car. Mm. I don't think mom would come in this car. No. She'll be scared. Mom would be way too scared. It's very good, but you just gotta be careful. I know. 
I am. And the thing is, you're hauling ass like that, somebody will cut you off, and that's all. I know. I know. I tried doing it like when there's no. You know what I could do? You don't have to, you know, prove anything. <laughs> I know. All right. I think my genie is more stiff than this. Year. Holy cow! <laughs> you gotta be Alex's leg to do this. <laughs> I'm giving you a little leg work. Yeah, I know. Is it newer? He has a sticker still on there. Look how many miles this shit has watched. Total. What? <laughs> it's brand new. And look at the map. Like it's huge. It's crazy. Yeah, like this shit's huge. I don't know. I get drank a couple. <laughs> Let me just give you a ride. Okay. <laughs> Everyone's scared. Oh, Alright, Mike, you're gonna be in a vlog. Okay, I don't know about this. <laughs> I guess should Mike, I my brother-in-law. I, I was drinking. <laughs> I see Mike's one got, got me into cars. Kind of. Huh? Yeah, I think I did take you to you your did. first car show. You took me to my first car show. You used to be into, uh, like, the, same shit I used to do, but back then. Did I drive you in the first M3? M3, the supercharged. I know he had an E46 M3, Laguna Seca blue, and supercharged. Yeah, that was fun. Even that today would be crazy. I miss that car. You shouldn't have sold it. I had sold it to buy a house, so that's what happened. So <laughs> Responsibilities? <laughs> I know. Manual. I know, I miss manual. Oh wait, we gotta put this on sport mode. <laughs> like sport plus? You're not allowed to do put sport mode. Oh, dude, did you hear the cops say Yeah, I was like, no way, it's in every car. <laughs> like, oh my god. <laughs> you that's paid for loud. it. There's no way I can't use it. Yeah. Like good shots. <laughs> that was insane. <laughs> 
Oh, look at my heart rate. It's up to 100. <laughs> I got 100 heart rate on that. It's spinning on the freeway. Like, it's yeah, kind of scary. It doesn't even get traction. The F80, the. Do you see the new one I got? Another one? F80? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That one, I put a tune on it, but like, that one sounds. The pops are like five times louder. Better? It's just like, boom! Yeah, the pops in my car are like babies compared to this thing. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy, y'all. I have like little pops. That was my brother's turn. But yeah, that was Mike, guys. So Mike actually, I feel like, got me into cars. He met my sister when we were. We were little, huh? Eight and ten. Yeah, we were really young when he met my sister, and he had an E46 M3, like I said. Lagoon Side Blue, supercharged. And he was into the car scene back then. He literally was like, he would take oh, us to car shows. Oh shit. Yeah, and all that stuff, you can scoot up. I give it to Mike teaching us about cars, teaching me about cars, M3 specifically. And it's crazy. I gave Mike a ride right now. What did he say? He was hyped. Is he going crazy? Yeah. He's like, I missed my car. Huh? I feel like he's not used to fast cars no more. But yeah, Mike is a huge BMW fan. I'm telling you, Laguna Sega Blue E46. So, anyways. Now can I cuss? Yeah, I just gotta do a lot of editing. Right, good luck. Not to. Good luck tonight. <laughs> this is my brother Alex. My I got little, a Marine's mouth, so I don't. My, my little big brother, and yes, he's a Marine. So there's a lot of Marines that watch my videos. I know. You guys all look the same, dude. There's so many GTRs on the base. That was kind of crazy. I seen Why like you have M2s. One? I seen GTRs. <laughs> I seen a G80, a bunch of G80s on the base. All the Marines look the same, bro. People come up to me like, I watch your videos. Oh, they look like this. Yes, dude. <laughs> you guys all have military haircuts. Yeah, I know. I drive a Jeep, so I'm not used to going fast. <laughs> oh my god. I think it sounds sick. Let's go on. Huh? Looks wide body already. Caffeine right now, I feel my heart. My heart's racing. I'm shooting the gym. How are you gonna drive? Can you sit on it? <laughs> oh my god, Nick, be careful. What? This Why are you is scared? I feel like a roller coaster. I hate roller coasters. Imagine mom in here. She would piss her pants. Fast enough? Yeah. <laughs> she was 
will not get in the car, guys. She's scared. I don't She's blame terrified. her. She, I'm not gonna lie. She's fast. You know what's crazy? It feels slow to me. <sighs> you got used to it, dude. There's no way. When I drove it yesterday, I felt fast. I was like, damn, I'm scared. But now I'm getting used to it. Giving everybody rides. <laughs> Was it fun? Yeah, it was scary. All right, that was super fun. I hope you guys enjoyed that little segment in the vlog of just giving my family a ride, introducing you guys to some of my family. That was my dad, my brother-in-law, and then my little brother and his wife. Since we're on the topic of family, and we're getting a little more personal in today's vlog, I really wanted to help my brother out. My little brother actually has a son, him and his wife. His name is Luca, there he is right there. You see Luca, my brother right there. I actually bought my brother those vans and his son, my nephew those vans as well so they have matching shoes but, but guys i really want to help my little brother out luca actually has a really rare i don't really know how to pronounce it but it's a very rare condition called open lip schizencephaly <laughs> i don't know how to pronounce it but i'll leave it right here guys it causes development delays such as walking not being able to sit on his own eat certain foods and also seizures as well he attends physical therapy four times a week that's provided by insurance but in luca's case he needs more intensive therapy such as tasty's or CME, which they have to pay out of pocket for. So they're just trying to raise some more money this year to help him get the therapy that he needs. And that's actually him trying to walk, which is really, really cool. It's my little nephew, bro, Luca, guys. So if I can ask you guys for anything, I never ask you guys for nothing on the vlogs, but if I can ask you for anything, I'm gonna leave my brother and his wife's GoFundMe down below. It's going to a good cause, I promise. I will not promote anything that isn't. You guys always show so much love to me, but if you guys wanna show some love to my family, my little brother and my nephew, you guys could donate if you want. If not, you can even leave a little like on my brother's uh, page, little nephew's journey page right there. But even a little like, or if you guys wanna go further and leave a little donation in the GoFundMe, I would greatly appreciate it. I know my brother and his wife and my whole family would also appreciate it so much. So if you guys do leave a little donation, Thank you, thank you, thank you, I appreciate it. I just wanted to mention that in the vlog for my brother, you know, I wanna show him some love. My nephew Luca is like the happiest little kid, bro, and I, hopefully with the help of you guys, we could all raise some money to help him with this therapy this year. I'd appreciate it so much, guys. But yeah, that's a little bit of some personal life of myself, my family. If you guys wanna see more personal videos like this, let me know down below. We'll probably make some more videos with my brother. Um, like I said, he's just very busy. He's actually based in San Diego, so he's very far from me. He's in the Marines, like I said. So we hardly have any time together. He does want to go like shooting, so we might do like some of that. Maybe like a little shooting range or something. Maybe take him to some more car stuff. I don't know. My brother's not really into that kind of stuff, but he enjoys it. He loves cars. Growing up, I've just been into cars, and he went like the military route. He loves the Marines. He loves guns. He loves all that stuff. Working out, especially. Like he's huge, as you guys can see. I said my little big brother because he's younger than me, two years younger, and he's huge, bro. He looks like my older brother every time i show people they're like there's no way that's your brother bro he's huge and then it was also very cool giving my brother-in-law a ride in the m2 today he was stoked i know he's happy like i said he was really into cars back in the day when he was like my age now that he's older it's cool to like bring the little kid in him out again and same with my dad i know my dad <laughs> it's funny when he gets scared bro i can tell when he's scared he gets quiet and he starts holding on tight bro but it was also cool to just give my dad an experience in the m2 as well but anyways one last time if you guys want to donate anything to my little nephew my brother's son luca the first thing down below the gofundme we're just hoping to raise some more money for his therapies this year. All right, guys, just left my parents' house. Before we head back to LA, we're gonna go meet up with the homie Jimmy. You guys all know Jimmy. <laughs> I feel like it's like a running thing now with the vlogs, but Jimmy always has new cars, like always. He always trades cars for new cars and all this stuff like that. In and out of different cars all the time. I don't know why Jimmy doesn't do YouTube, bro. That would be perfect for a YouTube channel, <laughs> going through different types of cars. My boy's had an NSX before, he's had an F80. R32 GTR, you guys have seen that. C7 Corvette. You've seen his NSX as well. I drove it in a vlog. The yellow Supra with bronze TEs, he yeah, has that. And he got a black F80, which I drove in a vlog, if you guys remember that as well. We switched cars. Bro, I'm trying to think. He's had so many freaking cars, but he just got another car. And this one is really freaking nice. I cannot lie. I've never seen it in person yet. He just got some new wheels. <laughs> Which you guys might hate or love it. We're gonna stop by real quick, check out the car in person. I've never seen it, and it's one of my favorite cars. It's all mistake. Also, by the way, I don't know if you can hear it in my voice, but your boy's getting sick, I think, bro. I mean, I've been doing everything possible to not get sick. I've been taking hella medicine every day, even like medicine to prevent sickness. Like, I've been taking everything, trying not to get sick, guys. Yeah, bro, you made the M240 nervous. <laughs> all right, we met up with Jimmy, guys. Yo, yo. First off, I wanna show him the clutch, because uh, <laughs> everyone's reaction is pretty funny. <laughs> Pretty stiff, right? Dude, like the R32. I mean, but yeah, you're used to the R32. That's what I was say. You're used to that. It's not bad. But it's definitely not no stock BMW. Oh, no, no dude. <laughs> it's definitely not stock. It's cool though, huh? Yeah. All right, now we get to the fun part though. Yeah, Jimmy's like see. 20th car. I don't even know. <laughs> Have you counted how many cars? No, I lost no? track. No, you got to count them, bro. Third F80 though. Third F80. <laughs> Look at this. Another F80. My first time ever seeing it. 
and he got new wheels today too so i got like the whole uh reveal <laughs> today <laughs> this shit looks crazy bro jimmy had that manual one that i drove it was manual right yeah. then he went to a dct one and after this DCT. one why have, have, should have uh, been the best icons, one icons. yeah honestly i saw you post that you said you bought it only because of the lights huh yeah damn that thing looks good bro it already has the carbon on it or you did it yeah it, it, it came pretty much like this besides the wheels yeah that's nice bro i should have brought my f80 yeah Ooh, that is clean how do you find these clean ass cars bro <laughs> yeah, i don't know man where'd you get this one from uh this one was in palm springs bro i don't know how you find these you just stay on Facebook, huh? Yeah. <laughs> wake up and look on. <laughs> he got intakes on it already. Yeah, the headlights are hard. The new headlights change, change everything, dude. dude. You need to have them. Yeah, that's sick. Congrats dude, on another one. Dude, four F80s now. Hugo, <laughs> David, David, all of you, us. And dude, then this one. we gotta get them and all your together. Other from LA? I know, dude. Let's <laughs> get them together. Let's do like an F80. Man. F80 cruise. I'll be sick. I love this color, bro. It's actually wrapped, guys. I thought it was paint, but then we got a little two series. Those are fast, aren't they? Text drive, dude. So yeah. all drive. I heard they're fast. So it's B58, all wheel drive. Damn. Yeah, you can make those shits fast. We out here, Beamer boys. Dude, that thing's sick. <laughs> you like it? Yeah. I took it because they're tuning my G80 right now. Yeah. And I was like, oh, I'll just take this. You have the same clutch, right? Yeah, same clutch. I drove it already and like my car already feels fast and the clutch is like super stiff. But they wanted to retune it to make it even faster, like dyno tune it. Dyno tune it and all that stuff like that, yeah. So my car's gonna be crazy. Hopefully it's done soon, but this shit's fun to drive. Before we head home, I gotta give Jimmy a ride in the M2. I don't think he's ever been in one. Jimmy's used to fast cars, all right? So I don't see him having the craziest reaction, but he also has a Supra, which is probably similar to this. It's probably similar horsepower. That would be a good race, to be honest. I feel like you're used to these fast cars, though. So it's not think, bad. I don't think you're gonna have that crazy of a reaction. But the thing is, it's four wheel drive, so it probably feels yeah faster probably than like it your is. Supra, no, no, nah, this thing's faster for sure, dude. You think so? Yeah, for sure. I'll just stay in the vlog right now. It'll probably be a good race. Nah, you, you'd beat it. <laughs> the vlog the f80s for sale <laughs> hit me up we're buying them too <laughs> oh shit oh my dude this thing is so I fast this. dude your g80 is gonna be rowdy dude yeah i can't wait for the g80 bro this thing's dangerous man <laughs> yeah whoever's giving nick these cars i dude, know bro like... That's what I'm saying. <laughs> and look i've been driving like that the whole time so I mean, <laughs> you dude, have to do it's an m car super reliable bro i'll trade oh, you yeah. dude straight trade right now dude the f80 is so Just clean it has a hood too, huh? No, no, it has. Does it? No, it looks it like almost, it the seat. Yeah, from the same wheel. Yeah, it does, but no. Damn. Yeah, it's, it's all nice done, besides the besides the wrap and like obviously the little bit of carbon. I want to give a huge shout out to Sam961 Motorsport, his shop, and Stage 4 Tuning for letting me borrow this car and pretty much beat the heck out of it. <laughs> but honestly, this car takes it, bro. It's super reliable. The Stage 4 Tune is super fast and reliable. You guys can see this is perfect proof and perfect proof of how fast it is. You guys seen everyone's reactions. This thing is fast, dude. I cannot wait until my G80 is done with the Stage 4 Tune. It's going to be so sick. As much as I love driving this M2, it's super fun. It looks freaking good. Everyone loves this car. Everyone stares at it. Everyone gives me thumbs up. I said in the last video, I think it gets more attention than my main green G80, which is crazy. People love this car. I don't know if it's the wing, the color. I don't know, bro. Hardly see them too. That's another reason why. But yeah, as much as I love driving this thing, I do miss my G80. I want my car back. And I want to see how it's going to feel once it's fully tuned. We should be picking it up maybe tomorrow, hopefully. So hopefully that's tomorrow's vlog. Again, if you guys want to help out with that GoFundMe link down below, I'd appreciate it so freaking much. You guys don't understand. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hopefully that was a cool vlog. I know it was probably a little bit short, but hopefully you guys enjoyed that video. Smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace. I might sip out this bottle until it get hollow. Shit, I might sip out this bottle just drowning my sorrows. Drowning my sorrows be better tomorrow. Cause these broken dreams is as hard as it gets. My nigga died at only 25. I'm thanking God for letting me see in 26. Shit.